James Middleton has revealed he used to write letters to his parents Carol and Michael begging them for a dog. The Princess of Wales' younger brother, 36, who lives in Berkshire, was a teenager when his parents bought their first pet. Speaking to OK! Magazine, the animal lover, who founded the pet well-being company Ella Co., said he wanted nothing more than a dog of his own when he was a child. James described how he was devastated that his parents, who were busy running their business party pieces, wouldn't let him look after a dog. As such, the determined youngster put pen to paper on several occasions to try and make Carol, 68, and Michael, 73, change their minds. He told the publication, ID, write letters to my parents to try to convince them to let me have one. It wasn't until James hit his teenage years that Carol and Michael finally relented and adopted their golden retriever Tilly. The Middleton's beloved pet lived to the age of 17 and even appeared in the Prince and Princess of Wales official first photo with their baby son Prince George alongside the couple's Cocker Spaniel Lupo in 2013. Reflecting on his love for his first dog, James said, I found a lot of solace in my dog, Tilly, particularly when I was a young teenager. She knew all of my secrets at the time, who I fancied and all of those little tricky parts that come with growing up that I never told anybody. Although Tilly passed away in 2018, James' beloved dog Mabel is her great-granddaughter. What's more, James also bred the Prince and Princess of Wales' current Spaniel Orla. The proud uncle went on to say that he was really pleased that Prince George, 9, Princess Charlotte, 8, and Prince Louis, 5, have a dog at home. He added, I see them being lucky that they have a dog in their life. Earlier this year, James sadly lost his 15-year-old dog Ella. He has previously credited the Black Spaniel with helping him overcome his mental health struggles and introducing him to his wife, Alize Thievenet. In January 2019, James explained in a personal essay for the Daily Mail how Ella had helped him through his depression battles. He wrote, during the day I'd drag myself up and go to work, then just stare with glazed eyes at my computer screen, willing the hours to tick by so I could drive home again. Debilitating inertia gripped me. I couldn't respond to the simplest message so I didn't open my emails. I couldn't communicate, even with those I loved best, my family and close friends. However, James says his dogs at the time, Ella, Inca, Luna, Zulu and Mabel, gave him structure at a time when he was struggling with his mental health. He added, Ella, particularly, has been my constant companion for 10 years and she's been with me to all my therapy sessions.
In her own particular way, she has kept me going.